Okay, so um, as explained in an earlier, earlier video, um, we are working in layers. And this means that if I try and click on any part of it, I can move it around and I can I can resize it. But everything else stays where it is, which um, isn't always useful, especially if you've finished and you just want to move the whole thing together. Um, you can press Control Z or Edit Undo to go back as before. So basically these are all separate at the moment and we want them as one because so we're going to group them. And to do that, use the black selection tool and drag it over all of them. Now you can see that the, the blue one here, the swirl, the first thing I drew with the freehand tool hasn't been selected. That's because that layer is locked because it considers it a background layer and by default it locks it so we need to unlock it. So if you grab the lock to the trash can down here that takes the lock off and then we can select them all. Great, and if you right click and click group or you can use a keyboard shortcut control G uh, you can also do most of these things from the drop down menus at the top as well and most of the things that you can do down in the properties bar you can also do in the drop down menus. But if I group them they all become one thing and then I can move them all at once. And I can also resize them all at once. And you can ungroup them again afterwards if you want your individual your individual items again. Okay, so that's grouping and ungrouping. And resizing.